Alright guys, so if you want to know how to take a window out, this is what you do. Basically, get the weatherproof seal, rip it off. Just like that. Next, you've got these little clips. Just flick them up a little bit. Then pry them out. Like so. So you'll have four of them, or maybe six, so there's one there, one there, one there, one there, basically go around and do all that. I'm just showing you how you do this next, get a standard blade, and you'll see there's a little channel where you've just took that clip off. Now that's got your mastic in, all you do, run your blade, literally you can just see it coming out there. It's quite hard to do this, but... So you just run your blade all the way around. I start at the bottom, cut up to about here, um, and then I'll get my pry bar in and start gently prying it, and then Emma will be on the other side to pull the window slowly, and then you just cut all the top, and the whole thing drops. That's it. I'll have this out in the next few minutes, um, yeah, and then we'll just carry on and do all the weather strips again. So it doesn't damage any of the metal work here uh, because that, as I found, is causing tension in a small area. So the bigger the bar is, the easier it is. Okay, so we need to get all this black mastic off. The best way that we've found is by using these putty scrapers. Um, basically, this stuff is really sticky. So once you get a good bit, you pin, like, sort of pinch it with the scraper, get a good bit, and then you can just keep using it against itself to pull, pull the other bits off. It's either the putty scraper or your fingers. Now trust me, after doing this for a whole day of pulling and pulling, it really hurts your skin. So this is a lifesaver. So what this product is, is Genolite Rust Converter, really good product, um, it's $60 for this uh, litre slash kilo tub, um, basically what will happen is after 15 minutes it will turn a black colour for the rust to convert it, um, you don't really want to do this for big areas that are rusted, um, you'd rather just replace the steel, but for little bits where the clips have been holding, which is what the problem is, like uh, that bit down here where is it actually that bit there so you can see how that started to go rusty and there's a bit on the edge there that'll convert that fine um, just basically paint it on and you just go from there as soon as that's done what we'll do is just basically cover it in red oxide primer um, because you won't be able to see any of this it's obviously going to be behind the window so that'll be us basically then we'll be able to put the window in with the butyl mastic and then that'll be another window done. 
Only another six to go, hey, Em? <laughs> Only another six.